Todd, a police officer who suffered a traumatic brain injury on the job, is getting ready to race in next year's Fresh 15, one year after the accident. KDK's Madison Herber right now joins us live in studio to tell us why she's racing for a very special reason. Madison. Neil, after months of speech and physical therapy, Officer Abby Rodseth is back on track and ready to run after a relentless road to recovery. On August 20th, 2020, Officer Abby Rodseth was in the last hour of her evening patrol shift when the unthinkable happened. I was over in the area of uh, Gentry in the Loop and the car um, was going somewhere around 75 plus miles an hour rear ends the back of my patrol car. A rifle was ejected from the rack hanging behind her head, leaving a mark but little memory from that night. And I don't remember anything like regarding the accident itself because it knocked me unconscious immediately. Spending the next several months in speech and physical therapy. Her trainer says she is the epitome of wanting something and going after it. She, she makes my job really fun and easy, uh, mainly because of her positive attitude and the strong work ethic that she brings to every training. Constantly adapting her workout plans as she continuously improved. She's able to do a lot more exercises and a lot more advanced exercises than what she was able to do back in October. And that's, that's a testament to not only her work ethic, but the fact that she's recovered so well and um, the level of growth that she's had from a muscular endurance standpoint and just a muscular strength standpoint. Just before her accident, Rodseth placed in the top five at the Fresh 15. As a former D1 athlete, getting back on track was one of her goals. I told them my goal was to be ready to race, like be in race shape to be competitive for Fresh 15. And now she is getting the chance once again to do something that has always brought her so much joy. I have this renewed joy of just being able-bodied, being able to run and do something I'm passionate about and enjoy and love, that in itself is the ultimate prize. Adding that she may have won the battle, but God has already won the war. She truly is an inspiration. Officer Rod Seth went to pick up her gear for the race this weekend. She says she can't put into words how good that moment felt. And we are wishing her the best of luck this Saturday as she gets ready to compete for the first time in more than a year. In studio, Madison Herbert, KETK News.